The women's golf team has performed extremely well this year, winning conference last week. Coach Braden took a moment to reflect upon the team's chemistry and leadership and how it has affected team play as the season winds down. Well, I, I think it's a really tight group of girls. They've, they've been together now for several years. We didn't lose any seniors last year. Um, and so I, I feel like that uh, they've been a tight-knit team, and that's really helped. We've had some, you know, I, we started off the year with one of our best performances ever. And so I, I just think the, the, uh, that they're good friends on and off the course, and so that's really helped the team chemistry. You know, really all of our seniors, I think, have been uh, really helpful all the way from, we've got Avery Michelson as a senior, and, and uh, you know, she's been our number one player for four years, so obviously she just leads by example and has really stepped up. Uh, Sophia Hudson's done a great job on varsity, and even Austin Lewis has done just a great job of mentoring some of our younger kids. So I think those three girls have really stepped up and done a great job this year. With State coming up, Coach Braden took a moment to explain the team's preparation for their biggest tournament of the year. Well, I think we're going to prepare the same way we've always prepared. Uh, they, they have a series of drills they work on uh, weekly. Um, you know, we, we try to get out of course a couple times a week and play. Um, so I don't think we're going to do anything different than what we've done. Uh, maybe work a little harder than we have, but I mean, they've been a hardworking group all year long. So, uh, you know, I think we're going to kind of keep doing what we've been doing. To play at the high level these girls do, they would have to prepare a lot during the off season. Emmy Braden and Avery Mickelson spoke to that. Okay, so during the spring and summer, I played a lot. I think we all did, which definitely helped us get some more experience for these upcoming tournaments. We also had the Bree North practices early on Tuesday mornings over the summer, and that kind of introduced us to the new team, especially the incoming freshmen who we got to know really well. We really like our new team. So, For sophomore Bailey Burkett, it has been a special season. As only a sophomore, she has broke the school's 18-hole record. So my reaction to breaking the school record was I didn't actually know until I got in the car and I checked Twitter and then my dad started reading the Twitter and it said that I broke the school record. And I was very shocked because I, I honestly didn't know what the school record was, so it was kind of cool to break it.